What do you know about the major social insurance programs we have here in the United States? I'm Jasmine Tucker, Research Analyst at the National Priorities Project. Here's what you need to know. Social insurance is made up of programs that help workers and their families replace part of their income that's lost due to unemployment, disability, retirement, or even death. It also ensures access to adequate health care. Every year, millions of Americans rely on social insurance. These programs touch nearly all Americans at some point in their lives, as most people draw Social Security when they retire or require medical care in old age. Social insurance programs are funded by payroll taxes and are part of what's called mandatory spending in the federal budget. Unlike discretionary spending levels that are determined by Congress, mandatory spending is controlled by eligibility requirements already in existing legislation. For example, the Social Security Act of 1935 established the Social Security program, which, among other things, pays retirement benefits to eligible workers starting as early as age 62. Social Security is a key federal social insurance program that workers and their employers pay into in order to be eligible for, for benefits. The program provides nearly 58 million people every year with retirement, disability, and survivor benefits. And unemployment insurance is an important federal and state program that provides temporary income to those who have lost their jobs through no fault of their own. The number of people who rely on unemployment depends on the economy. In good times, there are more jobs and fewer unemployed people. But in bad times, when jobs are scarce, more people rely on this program. For more on social insurance, earned benefits, and entitlement programs, check out nationalpriorities.org.